and we're back at it again and today we are going to be doing an ipsy versus ipsy unbagging video and why i'm doing that is because my mom recently signed up for ipsy so we're going to be comparing what i got in my bag and see if they follow my profile profile compared to my mom and see if they follow her profile so if you like these videos be sure to give it a big thumbs up and if you want to see what we got in our bags just continue watching alrighty so i'm going to start out the video and go in with my bag first so this month's bag is really cute it's got pink butterflies all over it and the bag is kind of like a vinyl feeling which i like that so we're just going to get right on into the bag here something got a little bit stuck alrighty so first thing in my bag I see is this little brush by glamour dolls it's got pink bristles on it I think it's really pretty it's an eyeshadow brush it's really soft and then next up in my bag let's see I got a Luna by Luna eyeshadow we've gotten these in previous bags I got the shade Celine that's what it looks like I'll go ahead and swatch it for you guys it looks like it's like a champagne color it's really pretty I like it and then next up in my bag I got this Hemp's Lips Ultra Moisturizing Herbal Lip Balm. That's what it looks like. It smells pretty good. It almost smells. Almost smells like it's got like vanilla in it or something. But I love getting lip balms in my subscription boxes just because I love lip balms. Who can't love lip balms? <laughs> Next up, I got the Ciate by London Starstruck Eyeliner. It says it's limited edition. So it looks like. So on one end is a velvet liner. Oh, it swatches really good. It's really black. And then on the other side you get a star stamp oh my gosh I'm so excited about this I'm so going to make a video using this eyeliner I'm stoked about this and then next up in my bag I got this dirty little secrets lip gloss and it's in the shade nude beach this looks really pretty it smells good too So there's it swatched right beside the eyeshadow. It's really a new color, so I'm just gonna say it's gonna almost appear kind of translucent on the lips and just kind of add a shine to the lips. But I like it. I like lip glosses. So, so that is it for everything in my bag. So let's move on in and see what my mom got this month. So here's her bag, of course, same thing. And I forgot to show you guys in my last bag that uh, the theme for the month was called Social Butterfly. I think it's pretty cool. So first thing in her bag, let's see, is this Trust Fund Beauty Glow Highlighter. Oh, this looks pretty. I'm not too big of a fan of liquid highlighters, personally, myself but she's probably gonna like this the color is really pretty though there's that swatch the last swatch on my arm beside the lip gloss I mean the color is really pretty it it really matches that eyeshadow I got in my bag that's funny so then next in her bag she got this Steve Laurent blush
here's the blush shade it's just the shade says it's rose all day it's a really pretty blush shade they're the last one on my arm it's not too bright not too deep i think it's really pretty i like this and it comes with a little mirror in the inside of it there that's 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 pretty cool i love getting blushers in bags and then she also got a Luna by Luna eyeshadow. Let's see what color she got. It's in the shade Spiced Pumpkin. Oh, that's really pretty. That is a really pretty copper color. That's swatched really good. I think that's pretty. I like that a lot. And then she got this NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream. I'm just going to swatch it here. That's really pretty. That shade is really pretty. It's like a really pretty mauve -y, I would almost call it a mauve burgundy shade. I, I like I, burgundy is my favorite color and last but not least in her bag she got a once finishing cream no instructions on the back but has a seal on it I'm just gonna leave it on there I'm guessing it's like a I'd say you could probably use it as like a primer probably so those are all the products in her bag so her profile is more like a kind of nothing too crazy keep it natural she likes a lot of makeup not much skincare so I would say that they followed um, her profile really well and my profile I think they follow pretty good too they all I always have pretty good luck with the ipsy like very rarely do I get something that doesn't follow mine mine is more of like crazy colors I like all things makeup no skincare and I didn't get any skincare in mine so um, hats off to Ipsy because I think they followed our profiles really well this time and so if you guys enjoy this Ipsy versus Ipsy showdown please give this video a comment like what did you guys get in your bags I'd love to know and um, don't forget to subscribe to my channel down below because y'all don't want to miss out on this fun stuff now do you <laughs> but I've had so much fun filming this for you guys and Thank you to everyone. I've reached 100 subscribers, which I am so excited about that. And let's just continue this journey. And yeah, don't forget that you are absolutely stunning. Bye, guys. Thanks for watching.